Well, tonight I can tell you that the victim continues to recover at the hospital shot here off West Broad Street. Police tell us the victim has injuries that are considered life threatening. But a gunshot, that's next level for sure. A Monday afternoon on West Broad Street. Yeah, it was a little unnerving. Peter Fraser recounts witnessing the aftermath of a violent crime. People shooting people is just, just, that's a bad way to start a week, you know? Fraser says he was walking back to his design business with his lunch when he heard a gunshot in the Lowe's parking lot. I heard a loud bang. I came alongside the Lowe's parking lot and there was a man there clearly um, distressed. In distress and needing medical attention. He had no shirt on, okay, it's 100 degrees, but he was holding his abdomen and walking around and there was another man there with his cell phone screaming for help and trying to get attention from everybody. Officers quickly swarm the area as customers continue to shop. I mean, I'm going to say two minutes maybe before there were three or four cops on the scene. It's unclear what sparked the shooting, but Crime Insider sources say Richmond police do not believe the victim was being robbed. He looked like a construction guy, you know, kind of a biggish, burly guy, some, like somebody you might see at Lowe's picking up supplies. As Fraser gets back to work across the street, nobody was running. He thinks about the man he watched fight to stay alive. Yeah, truly hope he's OK. And I just reached out to Richmond police for an update, and they still could not tell me a suspect description, but they're asking for your help. If you have any information about this shooting, call Crime Stoppers, the anonymous hotline, 780-1000. Working for you in Richmond, I'm Brennan King, CBS 6 News.